Dorf Romantic. Your first game of Dorf Romantic will start something like this. The sun beats down on a grassy field as a train passes by. The cottages nearby wake to the soft sound of the train beating against the tracks and the wind blowing through the trees. They hear the ducks leaving their roosts to land in a nearby pond as the farmers start their day in the fields. In Dorf Romantic, your aim is to place tiles on a hexagonal grid and have the edges of those tiles match with similar features. Doing so will reward you with a continual flow of new tiles in your stockpile, which you can add to the board one by one, building out a tranquil yet majestic landscape. For each matching side to a tile you place, points are added to your score. Placing a tile which completes the sixth matching side of any other tile will reward you with a bonus. These perfect tiles instantly give you another tile on the bottom of your stockpile, as well as a large amount of points. Of course, as you progress, you will come across challenge tiles. These tiles will request a specific condition for you to complete in order to receive an even greater reward. They may ask you to connect a certain amount of tracks or water tiles on the board, or create a contiguous forest or village which contains a certain amount of trees or houses. These tasks will seem simple at first, and in essence they are. With the proper planning and forethought, you will find there is often plenty enough room to add the required tiles. However, Careless placement brought about by unusual tile configurations or simple poor tile placement can cause these seemingly simple tasks to be far more challenging. As your landscape grows, you will also encounter one more type of challenge. Small flags can sometimes be noticed within the elements of your placed tiles. These flags indicate that you are requested to complete a continuous border around a set of elements on the board. These can be almost any types of element you find on your tiles from trees to houses, train tracks, bodies of water, and even cultivated fields. On first glance, you may even consider these challenges easier to achieve than the last type of challenge. I, however, have found this assumption often leads me to placing mismatched tiles in order to force the completion of an element's border, causing me to miss out on achieving the perfect bonus of the adjacent tiles. You could argue that the core of Dorf Romantic is the simple yet elegant tile placing puzzles you are asked to solve, but I would challenge that quite reasonable assessment the core that draws me into Dorf Romantic is its tranquility. Its ability to take even the most stressful of days using its enchanting soundtrack combined with its inviting visual styles and cut all those troubles of life away as you wrap yourself in the journey of watching a picturesque landscape unfold before you. That being said, whether you're looking for a challenging puzzle game or a soothing bath to wash away your troubles. Dorf Romantic is a cup of tea in the gentle presence of an old friend sitting down to play a board game with you at the end of a long day. <laughs>